welcome to Lynn's Recipes. Today I'm making sesame cheddar twist. The amounts of the ingredients that you're going to need for this recipe will be listed in the information box below or you can get them off the website. The ingredients are, you'll need puff pastry dough, toasted sesame seeds, a beaten egg, and some shredded cheddar cheese. You'll also need to preheat your oven to 400 degrees and you'll need a parchment lined baking sheet. I've laid my puff pastry out like this and now what I'm going to do is take my beaten egg and just brush it over the pastry. Okay, and I'm going to sprinkle it with the cheese. You could use Parmesan cheese or any other kind of cheese that you prefer if you don't like the cheddar cheese or if you just want to make something a little different. And now I'm going to sprinkle over some of the sesame seeds. I toasted these on the stove in a skillet and you have to watch them real carefully because they start browning um, pretty fast and then they would burn. So just be careful when you're doing that. Okay, then what we're going to do is take a pizza cutter and cut this in half horizontally and then we're going to start going vertically and we're going to have eight little twists. So now what I'm going to do is pull my baking sheet over and start laying them out. So what you do is you pick it up and you twist them like that and then you lay it out on your baking sheet. Okay, the last one, and I'm just going to take a little bit of egg wash and brush on the top. Okay, now this is going to go in our 400 degree oven for about 15 minutes until they're golden brown. My sesame cheddar twist cooked for 15 minutes and they're done. I took them out of the oven and let them cool and now I'm going to put them on a serving platter and show you what they look like. So these are sesame cheddar twist. I hope you enjoy them.